Hi, my name is Brida, and I am so grateful to have been led to the true Pope of these end times, Petrus Romanus, and the true Roman Catholic faith. And Petrus Romanus, the one that was founded 2,000 years ago, and Petrus Romanus is the last and final true Pope of these times. And Catholic means universal. And he is guiding his flock, made up of individuals from all faith backgrounds, people who are willing to humble themselves, repent, and learn how to be a true follower of Jesus Christ the Lord, who now prefers to be known as wisdom. And these are the end times, and things are different now. The true Pope is Petrus Romanus, and his wife, Mary Romanus, has a unique role in sharing this enormous mission with him. And they are one with wisdom, who lives and dwells fully within them, and they are God incarnate in the flesh. There were many prophecies about Petrus Romanus throughout history, a, a pope who would feed his flock amidst great tribulations. Saint Francis of Assisi, Saint Malachi and many other saints wrote of him. And Saint John Bosco had a famous vision of a great pope who would steer his ship to safety. And this is, this is what he saw. Sorry. <laughs> this, is, this is the vision he had. And we are seeing these prophecies unfolding before our eyes. The great ship is the Ark of Safety uh, with King Peter, with um, Petrus and the true faith with Petrus Romanus and Mary Romanus. And they are feeding us, the faithful remnant, with the finest heavenly food uh, to nourish our souls. And it is found at testimony of the two witnesses.com and their heavenly blog spot. For, and for all to come and eat freely at this heavenly banquet. It is the wedding feast of the Lamb, but to accept the invitation to, to come to the wedding feast of the Lamb, you need to humble yourself, repent, pray the burning bush prayer, and use the blessed holy water, and then to be cleansed, and then become a member of the faithful remnant. When I found the testimony of the two witnesses dot com, it was a, a miraculous divine intervention, and it was a the greatest moment of joy for me, and I was in awe at what I was seeing, and I knew I needed to repent and use the blessed holy water to be cleansed, and these are priceless gifts from heaven to us. And I knew in my heart, with absolute certainty, that I could trust Pope Peter the Last and his wife Mary Romanus more than anyone else in the world. The same way you would trust God. And it was supernatural. There was no human explanation for it. And since becoming a member of the Faithful Remnant in 2016, that faith and trust has grown, along with love. And there is also a holy fear, the same as fear of the Lord, um, because of who they are. Uh, but there is so much love, too, as they have been so kind and patient and loving to us, nurturing us and even disciplining us when needed, as any good parents would do for the betterment of our souls. And they have selflessly provided over three million words of truth, uh, of life-saving truth at the testimony and the heavenly blog spots, and with individual divine counsel for us members of the faithful remnant. And for anyone who attends any religious institution or organization or any place of worship, you are now being fed the true divine food that you need for your soul for salvation. True life and nourishment for our souls 
is only here with Petrus and Mary Romanus and wisdom. Francis in the Vatican is an imposter. He is an antipope and antichrist, the son of perdition spoken of in John 21 verse 12. And he is leading millions of his followers to hell on the broad path. He is the great deceiver. The true Pope, Pope Peter the Last, and his wife Mary are feeding us true food from heaven and leading us according to the will of wisdom along the narrow path as, uh, to salvation as long as we cooperate. So if you're not a member of the faithful remnant, do what it takes to become a member. Go to testimonyofthetwowitnesses.com and to the heavenly blog spot and repent and pray the burning bush prayer from the heart and use the blessed holy water and become a member and learn how to worship and serve the true deities who are also the two witnesses of Revelations 11 and they now rule over the entire universe with wisdom as King Peter and Queen Mary. And it is they who sustain us with life. So choose wisely and choose life here with them before it's too late. We exalt you King Peter and Queen Mary and wisdom and we thank you for sustaining us with life. And thank you for watching.